let's be very good and right here. So, May 2023 is special for Huawei as it has brought in headlines that were missing for the past three years. Yes, if you look at to the past three years, Huawei was like vanished from the global market, people around the globe was even started forgetting Huawei as there were no new phones, no global events and nothing. But it seems Huawei is finally back in action and has returned to the global smartphone competition and held 6 back to back launch events within a freaking month. Yes, you can't believe it, but this is true. Huawei has held 6 global launch events within a month. So, on May 9th, Huawei kicked off the unveiling of the Huawei P60 Pro and the Huawei Mate X3 foldable phone in Europe. The company achieved this conference with a will to represent these two flagships in the fullest in Germany. Alongside, Huawei unveiled the brand new Huawei Watch 4 series and this is the first in the global market ahead of China. Anyway, after two days, like on May 11th, Huawei chosen the Middle East market to introduce the Huawei P60 Pro and the Huawei Mate X3 along with various new devices. And on the same day, the launch train then reached the Asian market and the company announced these two new smartphones in Malaysia, the Philippines, Singapore and other prominent Asia-specific countries. After one day, like on 12th May, Huawei turned its sight to the Latin America region and launched the Huawei P60 Pro in Mexico and Colombia. After that, on May 18, Huawei stepped foot in the South Africa and took all of the gadget bags with them to fulfill consumers' expectations. By the way, the South African consumers were pretty excited about this unveiling event and right after that, on May 24, Huawei Japan launched the Watch Ultimate and the number of wearable devices such as the Band 8 and Watch Buds. So these back-to-back -back launches are giving a huge signal to all of the big dogs of the market which is Huawei is finally back into the market. So yeah, what do you think about this massive achievement of Huawei? Well, let me know your thoughts on it in the comments down below. And as always, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.